All right. I get nervous in front of crowds, so I have to write down my my thoughts and what I wanted to share with the team and James. I, I knew I'd get nervous and forget. I might get emotional and forget. So here, here we go. I didn't know if this speech should have been a sentimental, embarrass Athena, or be full of advice, or just congratulate you. So I'll do a little of all. Um, Athena, it feels like yesterday that you were just a baby and a toddler. I'm impressed and proud of the young lady. Huh? Look, I was with your dad, Alex, the day you were born. He was so proud of you. He took you with him everywhere. He bragged about you and showed you off to anyone, everyone that would listen. If you're here today, he'd still be bragging about you and show me off to anybody. I'm happy that you and James found each other. I remember the excitement of being young and in love. I realized that when I love your mom, when we're young and dating, that I just love spending every day with her. And when I wasn't with her, I missed her. And I know that's how you and James feel about each other this past year. Athena is determined, talented, smart, and beautiful. A couple stories of when she was young. Uh, one day, she was, she was preschool age. Destiny caught her sneaking our nice sample picture in her backpack. <laughs> Um, I guess during recess, she would get married to, to this boy <laughs> in preschool. And Jesse said, why are you taking this picture? And she said, I gotta show this boy where we're gonna get married. <laughs> but so all these years later, your determination paid off. Yep. You, you, you did it. Um, another story about Athena and being young and, and boys. <laughs> uh, she came home from school once and said, I think this boy likes me. And we, we said, okay, you know. How do you know? How, how do you know? And uh, she said, well, he laughs at all my jokes and I know some of them aren't even that funny. <laughs> <laughs> and I know James laughs at some of those jokes now. So. <laughs> um, James, welcome to being part of our family. When I met you, I knew you were a step above some of the other boys that Tina knew. I knew you could protect her and, and love her. You, you further proved this to me the night we, we changed the brakes on her car. <laughs> well, when I thanked you for your help, you said, well, that's my job. Uh, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna help her, you know, so. Um, you guys are a good balance for each other, and I'm excited to see your lives merge together. I'm sure you guys have had plenty of advice for happy marriage, so I'll keep this list short. Communicate clearly with each other. It's easy to have misunderstandings that can be cleared up with communication. <laughs> Always be kind and patient with each other. It's easy for kindness and patience to drift away over the years, so don't let it. Have plenty of laughter. One of my favorite things about your mom is she makes me laugh all the time. And go on lots of adventures. Uh, Try new things, try new foods, be your dumb selves, <laughs> and uh, it, it'll last, it'll make memories that'll last forever. So, may your love be eternal, and congratulations. And I'm including me and everything. And then I wanted to thank James. He's been <laughs> honestly so amazing. I couldn't imagine life without him. He makes me really happy. And I'm just so excited. <laughs> <laughs> to start life with him and just experience life and grow old and do all the fun things together. That's all I have to say. <laughs>
Love you, love you, love you.